All right, folks, back down the unit again. We're just having a bit of a clear up down here. We've moved the trot around. I've got a little bit more work to do on that, and I'm going to sand the doors down. So I'll see you in a minute. Right, so here we are down the uh, unit again. We just had a little bit of a move about because we've got a few cars and we've had to jiggle stuff about. But while, I'm while we've got this opportunity to move the uh, Reliant out, I thought we'd just do these doors and get these prepared. There's no work really to do on these apart from sanding them down. And while I've pulled this out, I've just noticed that uh, there's a little bit of a fine crack in the um, gel coat around here, which I'm just gonna have to dig out and fill. Let me show you. As you can see, just in the bonnet there, it's only a very thin thing, but Again, you don't really notice everything. That's why it's always wise to walk around the car a few times and let it settle down after you've done work so that you can see stuff. So that's just got to be sort of grinded out there. We'll put some fiberglass uh, P40 resin in there and obviously that will strengthen that right up. That's on the bonnet area, the corner of the bonnet area. And coming around the back here now, we've just got uh, all the panels for the Piaggio moped have now been sprayed black as you can see. We're just waiting to uh, do the top coat for these and that's going to be sealed under a uh, car 2k lacquer so that's going to be very durable just like the rest of the bike but you wouldn't believe how easy it is to move on this uh, jig here so that's a great little invention that and it's nice to see jimmy with the brush in his hand for once it's normally me that does all this i'm always doing it off the camera right so i'm just going to get myself sat up now and i'm going to start sanding these down so i'll put you on time lapse for that i'll see you in a minute Okay, that's it for the moment. I've just gone around the perimeter there and across the middle. Let's show you a bit nearer. So as you can see, I've taken it right the way back now to the uh, gel coat. And that lot there, around there, and also across the middle there, that's probably taken me about 15 minutes to do so. And that's with a, 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 a DA sander there. So always hand it around by hand. It'll take a lot longer if you're gonna do this sort of thing by hand. So this other large panel here, I can also do with the DA sander and things like the inside of the edges. I may be able to get that along the line like that, but then there's obviously gonna be bits where you need to use your hand around the curves and stuff like that. So I'm just gonna carry on and do this, get the other two doors done, and I'll see you at the end of that. So see you in a minute. Oh, hold on, wait there, who's that? Oh, hello, come in. Good morning, the name is Bond, James Bond. Um, I've come to pick up the Aston Martin. I'll have to find out about that. Jimmy? Yeah? Have we got an Aston Martin in? No, not this week. For a Mr. Bond? No, I never heard of him. Well, <laughs> Sorry, I... mate, we ain't got an Aston Martin in. Well, M did tell me to come and pick up the Aston Martin. Oh, yeah? Um, if not, do you have a Trans Am that I could use? <laughs> I've got a Trans Am from a bloke who I know, but it's being resprayed at the moment, mate. Oh, well, I, I really need a car, actually, because uh, in my profession, one needs a fast car. Um, do you do you have anything else? Well, I've got something else we're working on at the moment. I don't know whether it's your style, but it's entirely up to you. I trust it's 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 okay, is it? Well, to be honest with you, it is actually starred in films anyway, so it is the TV car. I know you like a famous car. I think it will suit you down to the ground. Do you want to see it? Well, um, is this safe? Um, it doesn't have a steering wheel. Uh, surely I need a steering wheel, otherwise I won't be able to go anywhere. Uh, what am I going to chase my villains with no steering wheel? Uh, um, I think the car needs a few things doing to it. Uh, it's not quite uh, up to scratch. What do you recommend? Oh. Ah, it's a 
it's taking me so long to do this. Do you know what? I've been daydreaming. I was dreaming about some bald-headed bloke in a my bleating Reliant Regal. Unbelievable. Right, so we just done a little move about the car. Started to rain outside. Oh, hello. Hello. Look who's just turned up, everybody. It's really cold out there, I tell you. I just, had a, funny enough, I just had a funny daydream that you was here earlier Did on. Yeah. yeah, someone who looked very much like you. Couldn't have been you because it's supposed to have been James Bond. James Bond? Yeah, what are you yeah. rubbing your hands? You're not going to produce a genie, are you? James Bond, wasn't it? Oi, it James was Bond. you. <laughs> My what have you been up to? <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, you, oh, you got a bigger one than them than me. Ooh. <laughs> I'm going to do it again. Look. Last time I here, I got a bloody dirty. Hey? You'll never see this. Because you'll have to edit it out. I won't edit right. it out. Now listen here, who am I? Wait a minute. See what I'll put up with you. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Here we go, let him play his games. I'm getting out of the camera. Who do you think I am now? I'm Top Man. Oh, uh, not Top Man. Brick, Brick. Top. Top. Right. Brick Top. I'm going to send the, the boys round. Out of the film Snatch, that's who he's supposed to be. I'm going to send the boys round. Brick Top. Does right. not say right. sorry. I'm going to see the boys ring. Unbelievable. Oh, okay. This is his acting. And another thing. Yeah? Your video, someone said, it's about time you had Lee in it a bit more. So you start bringing him in, because your videos are going bloody dull. Don't come in here dictating to me. You might be slightly taller than me, and I don't want you coming in and having a go at me, Jimmy. We're doing you a favour by doing your crap trans am, all right? Have you quite finished now? Yes, that's all I'm going to say. So next time, pick on someone your own size. Now get off the bucket. Unbelievable. I just had another little flashback moment then. That you was a lot bigger than me. Is that a so? Is that a so? <laughs> anyway. Got a couple of uh, new cars just come in. Let's just have a quick look at it. Alright, so the last one today is we've got this BMW which is uh, just come in. Jimmy's got to refurbish the wheel. It's got some scuff marks around it. So, uh, taking all four wheels off. Jimmy's going to have to sand them down, refurbish them, put them back on. But as you can see, it's in here now and uh, just waiting to go. We're going to go now, it's turned uh, 5 o'clock now, dark outside. I've got to get Lee home to get back to his uh, dressing up box. Me and Jimmy are going to go out and have some tea. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this little video. Don't forget to rate, comment and subscribe and also share. See you later, bye for now.